What's going on YouTube? I am back with another video and in this one we have an SGC grading preview. So uh, these are cards that I am personally sending. These are not part of a group submission. Um, you guys might have seen a video that I recently put out where I opened that Marvel Metal Universe Spider-Man box and uh, pulled a lot of cards that I want to go ahead and get graded by SGC. Now, some of these cards I do want to hold on to, uh, but there's a decent amount here that I do actually want to sell. So I want to go ahead and get them sent out to SGC as soon as possible so I can get them back and be one of the very first ones to market with some of these graded cards. So the turnaround times with SGC, you guys, I'm sure are familiar, very, very fast. So I'm actually recording this video on Monday the 29th. I'm going to send these out the very same day. So I'm going to do FedEx today. They should be delivered on Wednesday. And honestly, I would not be a bit surprised if these are not done and headed back to me by Friday. Uh, that's, I believe the last group submission I sent in, uh, they were received and graded in one day. So uh, hopefully these will be shipped back on Friday and I'll you know, potentially get them on Monday, which would be an exactly one week turnaround time. So uh, that's the goal here is, uh, you know, to be first to market with some of these cards that I do want to sell. And uh, with that being said, again, uh, these are all going to be from that Marvel box. So if you guys are not interested in seeing uh, what Marvel cards I am sending to be graded, this is not going to be a video for you. Uh, you know, unfortunately, I just, car you know, cards that I've, sports cards that I've pulled recently are either you know, in my opinion, not worth grading or not in good enough condition to grade. So uh, unfortunately, I just don't have a ton of stuff to grade right now. Uh, but I thought the for the most part, the, the Marvel stuff that I opened from that box looks pretty good. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. And uh, with before I do get into it real quick, I uh, just want to say if you guys have not subscribed to the channel, would certainly appreciate it if you would do that. Uh, I am planning a big uh, get, uh well, giveaway and video for when I do hit 25,000 subscribers, which will hopefully be soon. We're about 500 away. So uh, yeah, gonna be the biggest opening on the channel ever. So very, very excited about that. So first up, we are gonna send in our PMG that we did pull out of that box. So got very lucky and hit a PMG. Uh, I have seen, you know, there's definitely boxes out there with no PMGs. And then I've seen some crazy boxes where people have pulled like two or three PMGs from one single pack. Uh, and you know, they might get like two, three, four PMGs in the same box. So uh, kind of weird how that's worked out. I don't know how, you know, Upper Deck went about doing that. Some have none, some have two, three, four. So kind of crazy, but luckily I was able to hit one and we did hit the high series Molten Man Red PMG. So gonna be number to 100. I don't think this is really, you know, necessarily the craziest PMG you could hit. Obviously, uh, Spider-Man, Iron Man, Wolverine, whoever are, are going to be worth big, big money, uh, but still a very, very cool card. Definitely want to get this graded. These are highly, highly collectible. So uh, I am planning on probably letting this one go. And I do think it will probably get a nine. There is a little bit of edge wear um, on the, uh, the back edges. Uh, you know, these are always going to be tough grades, super, super condition sensitive. Uh, but hopefully this one can pull a nine and I do plan on letting this one go. So uh, next up, we do have the um, gold. So you do get three golds per box. One of my golds was the Ant-Man, which is a very, very cool card. Um, honestly, might hold on to this one. I kind of want to hold on to all of like the Avengers cards. So might potentially hold on to this one. Not exactly sure, but very, very cool. Was happy to pull. This was definitely my favorite gold that I pulled. So the gold Ant-Man, super cool card. And then we are going to um, send in the Craven. So... Um, I'm not super familiar with this character. I'm, you know, I like Marvel. I'm a big Avengers fan, but all of these characters, you know, throughout the years and comic books and stuff, I'm not familiar with. This is not one that I'm really super familiar with. So I am going to sell this one. This was one of our numbered cards out of that box as well. So we, we got the Molten Man PMG and then we also hit the Craven out of a hundred. So we are going to grade this one and that one will be available. So um, and you know, if you guys out there are interested in buying any of these, definitely feel free to hit me up and I will definitely plan on doing a, a reveal video on this submission. So uh, if you guys want to hit me up and, you know, call dibs on something, we can definitely work something out. Uh, we are going to send in one of the grandiose parallels. So this one was, uh, the high series beast and you do get two of these grandiose per box. So going to go ahead and send in the beast. 
And then one of the other metal cards was Black Bolt. So we got the High Series Black Bolt. The other gold card out of the box was a High Series Nova. I'm not gonna send that one in. Um, I just, again, wasn't super familiar with that character. So I'm gonna leave that one out, hold on to it. Um, but the, uh, the second gold card from the box was Black Bolt. So we are gonna send that one in. And then uh, we are gonna send in the Hobgoblin. I thought that one, uh, you know, looked really, really cool. I like that character. So we're gonna send that one in. And then I believe the rest of the, nope, sorry. Uh, let me kind of rearrange these because the last few I definitely want to hold on to. So the other grandiose uh, parallel was Black Bolt. So I think we got like three or four Black Bolts in that box. Uh, but this one is really, really cool looking. I really like the low series better than the high series. Um, and this again was the grandiose uh, parallel. So again, two per box. That was the second one. Uh, this one will uh, be available as well. Very, very cool looking card. Now the remaining cards I do think I'm gonna keep, it's just gonna be like base cards, but it's either really, really big recognizable characters or uh, you know characters from the Avengers. So first up, we are gonna send in Captain Marvel. And this is one of my favorite cards. I think the artwork looks incredible on this card. So really, really big fan of this. And the, you know, the goal with all these, the remaining cards, I don't really care what grades they get. I just want to get them slabbed up. And you guys are probably going to see these either in the background up here or maybe in the background here. So these are going to kind of be display pieces. I think these cards look absolutely amazing. So really, really excited to get these slabbed by SGC, which I forgot to mention, I think, the Marvel cards look really, really good in SGC slabs. I just think they look better than like PSA or any of the other grading companies. I really like just the black borders, kind of complements the uh, the card. So anyway, Captain Marvel, excited about that one. And then I do plan on keeping Carnage as well. So really, really liked the most recent movie, the Venom movie with Carnage. That was a really, really good movie. I, I, I liked it a lot. So I think Carnage is a super cool character. So. Uh, plan on holding on to that one. And then we have Thor. Um, honestly, Thor might be my favorite Avenger. I really, really like uh, his character. So I uh, really like that one. And then another really cool artwork was Wolverine. They made him look awesome in this one. He's just absolutely jacked and looked just super angry. So really, really like that one. So we definitely plan on holding on to Wolverine. And then another Avenger here, we have Iron Man. I think they killed it on this artwork as well. Uh, the artwork in, in you know the whole series is just incredible. So we've got Iron Man there, and then we have Hulk, another Avenger character. So we're gonna send that one in, and then finally we are gonna end on Miles Morales. Unfortunately, I did not pull a Spider. <laughs> excuse me, I did not pull a Spider Man from my box. Honestly, you know, that would have been the one like base card that I really, really wanted to pull. Didn't pull the Spider-Man, but we did pull Miles Morales. So probably gonna hold on to that one and maybe pick up like a Spider-Man on eBay or something like that. So excited to send these in, excited to get them, you know, back and see what they grade. And again, uh, most of those like the Avengers and big characters will be display pieces. So uh, look forward to showing, showing you guys the results when they are back, hopefully in about a week or so. So uh, yeah, gonna go ahead and wrap this one up. Just wanted to show you guys a quick uh, preview of what I am sending to SGC. So hopefully you guys enjoyed and I'll see you soon.